There were several 9-11 ceremonies and events today in central Kentucky. Alex Valverde continues our big story team coverage. 8.46 a.m. That's the time the first plane struck the North Tower of the World Trade Center 18 years ago. And at that time this morning, a timeline of those day's events were read aloud outside of the Department of Criminal Justice Training at Eastern Kentucky University. Remember, this is the largest attack you know, in, in U.S. history of, uh, you know, on, on American soil as far as loss of life. Students, faculty members, and recruits listened to those details, followed by a moment of silence and a prayer for those who lost their lives. Many of them people who risk their lives to help others. That's something to be said about the American spirit. And so from that end, we celebrate it. And then on the opposite side, we mourn because you lost all those people that were of that mind. Ruth Madeline McCourt. Over Charles at the University Austin of Kentucky, McCream. the names of those who died that Toledo, day, all 2,977, were read out loud. American flags were placed on the ground at the front of campus. Also in Lexington, a flag raising and wreath hanging ceremony was held at Phoenix Park at the Fallen Police and Fire Memorials. Lexington Police Chief Lawrence Weathers reflects not just on that tragic day, but also its aftermath. It brought us all together for a common cause. It made us truly what we need to be and what we should always be. It made us one. Showing that no matter how much time passes, Americans continue to hold on to the promise to never forget. In Lexington, Alex Valverde, LEX 18 News.